Get your St. Louis MMA fix at knuckledogies.com. This video is sponsored by Brad Carey with Realty Executives Premier. If you're looking to buy or sell your home, call Brad Carey. Need a lawyer who fights as hard as you? Call John Meehan, attorney at law. Um, so the Respect event is coming up on February 28th. Um, it's, a, it's a new event um, here in St. Louis that JW Wright is putting on. Pretty excited about it. It's kind of like a, a Metamorph style event where it's, it's professional grappling. Um, he brought together you know, a lot of big names in the area and also you know, some big names from out of state. And uh, basically, it's you know I think there's about eight black belt uh, matches, uh, and then a handful of purple and brown belt matches, and uh, you know each of us are kind of you know putting it on the line against someone you know from out of town. Um, I'm going against a guy named Pete Wilhelm from uh, uh, the Triton Fight Center in Tulsa, Oklahoma, and I'm really excited about the matchup. I'm training hard, and uh, you know I'm definitely going to make it exciting for the fans. You know the training for an MMA fight and um, you know super fight and grappling is very very different. Um, you know MMA is, is much harder on the body and it is kind of nice with uh, with the super fight as you can just focus on one thing. You know just focus on jujitsu and that's already my passion. That's already what I spend the most amount of my time doing. Um, so I feel like I'm not saying it's you know necessarily like easier I think it's just easier on the body you know um, because with the, with the MMA fight you know you're, you're working your striking you're working your grappling um, you're working your wrestling and on top of that you just your body's just taking a lot more punishment you know with the jiu-jitsu you know in the gi especially you can slow the game down a little bit and um, you know I think it's a lot it doesn't take as much of a toll on the body there's definitely a little more pressure when um, you know you're on your uh, you know you're in your hometown and you know I do have a lot of students coming so you know to watch but you know I'm a competitor and I've been competing for years and years and uh, you know at the highest level both in jiu-jitsu and MMA and um, you know so I've, I've gotten really used to um, you know dealing with the, the butterflies and the nerves and and honestly man you know just like anyone else anytime I compete everybody's nervous I'm a little nervous of course but I but I really love to compete I love it I love every second of it I love just that moment right before the match starts stepping on the mat I love like looking at my opponent and saying like all right let's see what you got you know have you been training uh, harder than I have you know and just just test yourself so I truly love it um, and also I try to really hard to lead by example for my students and they know that I compete all the time you know sometimes I win sometimes I lose so I don't put that kind of pressure on myself that like I have to win because a certain person is watching um, I think my students respect the fact that I always put it on the line and uh, but I can guarantee you know that I will fight very hard and I will do my best and, and I think as long as I uh, continue to lead that way um, you know I'll always have the respect of my students and so it's not it's not really that much pressure people should come to the respect event because st. Louis hasn't seen anything like this style of event like professional grappling um, you know we've had our regular jiu-jitsu tournaments but this is a little different and plus we haven't seen this type of talent level all pulled together this many black belts from all over the Midwest and like you know all the main schools in St. Louis so I think not only are you going to get to see a lot of big names you wouldn't normally get to see compete um, but you get to see them pit themselves against each other like style versus style and um, I just think it's going to be really exciting and uh, you know everybody's going to be uh, I think they're given uh, finishing bonuses um, so you know you guys, you guys are going to be putting it on the line to try to uh, really really uh, get the finish so I think it'll be exciting I think everybody should come out and support because the thing is with the shows like this is that the only way they can keep going is that people support them and um, you know this one this card is already a fantastic lineup so people come and support it and say and, and not only are they going to get to see an exciting show but then uh, you know the show will see that hey there's a demand for this and they'll be able to have more and bring even even bigger names in the next time so you know come out and show we promise we'll put on a good fight Get your St. Louis MMA fix at knuckledogies.com.